hi guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for being here with me so today i'm going to be reacting to dave trump and compared hillary clinton to darth vader mm. <laughs> he compares hillary clinton to darth vader and guys if you want to join this beautiful family of one words you know what to do smash that red button turn on the notification bell too so without wasting any time let's go straight into the video Yes, I voted for Hillary Clinton. Of course I did. I voted for her because I liked what she said vastly better than I liked what he said. But to be honest with you, at that point, <laughs> that shit was like watching Darth Vader do the I Have a Dream speech. <laughs> that bitch is mean as hell. She had already... Karate Kid swept Bernie Sanders' legs from underneath him. Boy, it was hard voting for that shit. <laughs> but that, it was the lesser of the evils. I know you were a Clinton supporter, Miss. I am sorry to say like that. It didn't feel bad voting for her. I really loving, loving, loving the way he's imitating. <laughs> but it didn't feel as good as it should have. She was gonna be our first woman president. They were gonna make coins out of this bitch. And somehow she just missed the dunk. Of course she should have beat him. Of course she should have beat him. You know what voting for her felt like? It was bittersweet. <laughs> it felt like I was lucky enough to eat Halle Berry's pussy. <laughs> and whilst I was doing so, she fucking farted in my face, man. Now you understand, I'd still do it. <laughs> but boy, I wish she didn't fart in this great nation's face. <laughs> I voted that day, and then that same day, I flew to New York City. I had work. That night, I was in a comedy club in New York, and I said to an audience almost exactly what I just said to you. And I didn't know that there was a journalist in the room. And this journalist wrote an article. Oh. The headline of the article said, Dave Chappelle. The journalist just wrote this. Dave Chappelle is an avid Trump supporter. <laughs> is an avid Donald Trump supporter. <laughs> yeah. I had no idea the paper said that. And you know how I found out? My wife called me from Ohio the next morning in a goddamn panic. <laughs> David, David, what the fuck is going on in New York? I said, I'm being good, but what have you heard? <laughs> and my wife said, the paper is saying that you're a Donald Trump supporter. I was like, whew. I said, don't worry about that shit, baby. <laughs> Nobody in their right mind would believe that. And she said, no, David, people believe it. And then she started reading the comments to me. Oh, they were terrible. <laughs> That's a very serious allegation from one black to another. Mm. All these black people call me all kinds of Uncle Toms and shit. <laughs> I should tell you, buddy, this is a very serious allegation from one black to another. I was incensed. Uncle Tom! How am I Uncle Tom, nigga? You the one that reads The Observer. Anyway, oh. all this shit goes down. And uh, Saturday night rolls around, and now Trump is the president, and I'm hosting Saturday Night Live. And I didn't really like prepare my monologue, I just kind of winged it. And at the end of the monologue, I don't even remember what I said. I said something like, you know, fuck it, like we're uh, historically disenfranchised and we're gonna give him, something about we're gonna give him a chance if he gives us a chance. I don't know what I said, but whatever I said, I, I really wish I didn't say that shit. <laughs> it was not worth the trouble. Now I walk into the barbershop and all them black people just be looking at me like, yo, Dave, what's up with your boy? 
Yo, nigga, yo! Not my boy. Because <laughs> I don't care if you're a Republican or Democrat, if you support him or not, any objective person is gonna have to admit that uh, this motherfucker is having a terrible go of it. Oh. This shit is just bad than a bad job. It's scary to watch, wow. <laughs> It really is. <laughs> We've had presidents before that have done bad jobs, but this shit is worse than a bad job. It's scary to watch. <laughs> Holy shit, it's like seeing a crack pipe in your Uber driver's passenger seat. There you go, guys. Dave Trump El compares Hillary to Clinton to Darth Vader. Oh my goodness. Whoa. I really love, love the David Chappell. He is actually an intelligent guy here. <laughs> oh my goodness, I can't stop laughing it out. So guys, thank you so much for being here with me. Hope you enjoyed this beautiful, beautiful comic here by Dave Chappell. Comparing Hillary Clinton to Darth Vader. And guys, if you want to join this beautiful family of ours, you know what to do by smashing, smashing. Hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell too. So let's talk up next time, simply.